But, but you talk about how we really can do what we put our minds to doing without having that conformed nine to five type of job. We don't have to be like our parents were. We don't have to put on a, necessarily even the khakis and the blue shirt. We can figure out ways to earn cash on our own these days, can't we? Absolutely, absolutely. And I think that's the driving force. Uh, interesting story actually, right after I graduated, at that time I was like 22, uh, that's when I decided, hey, nine to five is not for me. And I know a lot of people, nine to five is not for them. So there's this concept of sharing economy that came up and we started doing some more research in it. And we we're like, oh, cool, this is amazing. You don't need to be tied to that, that corporate thing, that mindset that everybody is tied to. And you know, you can actually just uh, self-sustain yourself if you just engage with the community you're in. So tell us about sort of the collaboration efforts of, of kind of these communities that can A, help obviously save you money, but can also help make you money. Absolutely. So as you mentioned, like, you know, I, I run this company called Ask for Task. Uh, it's like essentially an app or a website where you go and you tell uh, our, our system what you need help with. So it could be anything from cleaning to lawn mowing to handyman work to even like, you know, if you're moving or if you need your dog walked, right? So essentially what's happening is that we're, we're, we're in the business of connecting two kinds of people, people who are looking to you know just free up some time and spend that time with family, with friends and all that stuff, and people who actually have extra time on their hands and they would like to help people in their neighborhood and mm. actually you know make some extra cash. Uh, 